Good afternoon, hello, welcome to the Triathlon Dan YouTube channel, the cycling and triathlon YouTube channel where I never have my helmet straight. There we go, ish. Anyway, welcome back. Thank you very much for your patience and your support throughout the little series that I put together, Focus, or I keep forgetting what I called it. Anyway, long videos. You guys are busy, I get it. Here's a short one about a really easy brick session. So you join me on Monday. It's just the day after I finish my four week training block. So I'm not really very fresh. I need to take a few days to let that training absorb, let me feel a bit better. So tonight I'm just out for, I've done no training today. I'm out for a half an hour test flight spin on the TT bike, not really doing any, I've got a power meter on, no heart rate monitor. I've just rolled out to a local industrial estate. I'm just doing some laps up and down, trying to get some footage on this camera, but also just trying to get used to the TT position without the stress of traffic. I'm just thinking, Am I going to be okay racing this this year or not? Because I've got a time trial tomorrow. Anyway, more on that later. So, this is the TT bike setup. Now, please excuse there not being a nose cone on there. It's just because I'm just trimming the gears just so they'll work correctly. So, rather than taking a nose cone off every five minutes, I can just have that open. Um, what's changed since last season? Well, quite a lot. I've got some uh, brackets on the base bar, which makes my front end a little bit longer. Well, it's different armrests, uh, different wheels. That's quite a big change. I think that's about it. The group set's the same, the saddle's the same, the position is vaguely the same, the extensions are the same, but I've gone a little bit longer and a little bit narrower. I can't actually get any more narrow than, than I am there because that is about it and it, these, uh, these chaps take some squashing together. Anyway, feels good. The back brake doesn't really work, the front one does, so 50-50. Um, yeah, it's really hard to test around here because it's so hilly, like I'm, I'm struggling with it. I've got 58 tooth front chain ring on, I'm struggling getting up the hills, I can't spend much time in a TT position, but feels good getting on the race bike. Anyway, let's have a little spin, get home, and then I'm going to go for a little run. See you there. Okay then, bike done, onto the run, which I've also already done. 27 minutes, it's gone off screen, but I'm gonna pretend it's on here. 27 minutes, 45 seconds, 3.15 miles, just under nine minute mile in. Real nice, steady evening run. And I didn't need to stop for a poo, which is always a positive on an evening run for me. So long will that continue. I'm an absolute fashion guru though, in bib shorts and t-shirt, but there you go. <sighs> well, how do I feel now? Good. Really good. This is only the day after I finished my last training block, so I'm not gonna feel like amazing, but I do feel okay. The last few weeks I've been doing like three hours on the bike on a Monday night, so I feel like I've got a whole evening left now for a change, which is excellent. Um, this week for me is all about freshening up, but also doing a little bit of testing. So tomorrow I'm gonna go and do the local five mile time trial. So I did it at the same time last year. So I can measure myself against that, obviously use the power and heart rate and speed and stuff as well. Um, I might do a ramp test later in the week. I'm toying between, obviously I run out of days, don't I? So I'm toying between doing a bike ramp test or doing a run test uh, of a loop that I did two or three months ago. I'm not entirely sure which one is more worthwhile, but I'm gonna see what the weather turns out like this week, see how the week goes in general, and then come back to that. So uh, more regular videos as well. Now I've got a bit more time in my hands. I'm not gonna commit to, I'm gonna be doing a daily vlog, but I'm definitely gonna put some more videos out this week. So thank you very much for your support in advance. Hope you enjoy them. And that's it for today. Feels really good to just stitch a little brick session together. <sighs> Flies. Hope your training's going well. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you maybe tomorrow at 4pm or 1pm. Who knows? Oh, I don't even know. Bye. <laughs>